Hello everybody, my name is Retrolyzer and welcome back to Soldiers Heroes of World War 2 where we're going to be moving swiftly onwards to Rendezvous in the English chapter of our adventure. Well, I say English, I mean United Kingdom, but still. Back at the shore, the Germans didn't know what had hit them. The Condor squad had used the enemy's own guns to take out the nearby lighthouse before destroying the artillery itself to prevent the destruction of Trident. After the excitement, they set off towards the town of Saint-Paul-sur-Mer and the next objective. The team had been briefed back on Trident that they were to make contact with a French resistance agent. The only information given was the rendezvous location in Saint-Paul-sur-Mer and the password. Well, that sounds fair enough. Let's go and do exactly that and get involved with this and see how well it pans out. Although, it can't be that easy, surely. It's going to be a disaster from start to finish, I am very sure. Only one way to find out. The town of St. Paul Sumer is swarming with Germans. The actions at the coast have stirred up a hornet's nest. Despite this, contact must be established with the French resistance agent to gather as much information as possible about the location of the V3 crash site. Well, that sounds fair enough, but first things first, get yourself inside that building, because the last thing we need is to have ourselves detected by a half-track of all things. Now, let's see, first get yourself armed with that. Might want to do the same with that well rod. Load it up. Glorious. And wait for them to pass by. Sten Mark 1? That is definitely not a Sten Mark 1. In fact, judging by um, the stock, I think it might be a Canadian pattern um, Sten Mark 2, I think. I can't quite remember the exact differences, but uh, I do know that uh, that particular kind of wire frame is um, particular to a, di a particular country. I'm unsure, however, which one it is. But it is certainly one of the Commonwealth nations. Still, first things first, let's have a quick look around. Hide in the bushes. Now, one armoured car, Flak 88, prime mover, machine gun nests, plenty of infantry, machine gun nest. Flak Panzer on a Mark I chassis, Prime Mover, Naval Werfer, yes, this isn't going to end well at all. So, first priority is to go and take out those chaps there by the um, armoured car. The last thing we need is to be, um, well, approached by one of them. Especially since it's armed with a 20mm auto cannon, and that will result in total disaster. Now then, I'm probably going to have to take out these guys, but I'm unsure whether doing so will. No, it didn't um, cause anybody to be um, suspicious, so without further ado, go and uh, take that and then start moving even closer. However, if a single soldier gets inside that armoured car, we're done for. As such, we need to be extremely careful when we approach. So, direct control. Open fire! Shit! Got him. Perfect. Phew. Ow, could you not, son? Right, he's down and out. Ow. There we go. However, we're not out of the woods yet. On the contrary. These Germans will be desperate for our blood now. Uh-oh. 
I wonder where these guys are coming from. Tough luck, I'm doing well. Now. Get the rest of these chaps. Go on, son. Take him out. Shit. Not good. Oh, really? Blighty? Glad to hear it. We love our damp, wet island. No word of a lie. Uh-oh. Yeah, there's a lot of people um, trying to get us now, which uh, doesn't really bode well for us. However, nobody has bothered to man I spoke too soon. They've gone and manned the uh, anti-aircraft gun. That was the last thing I needed. Get yourself some ammunition and let's get moving. Good shot, good shot. However... There's another German behind that car. Come on. Son of a bitch. Show yourself. Oh, shit. That's not good at all. The last thing I need is to be um, harassed by that. So, moving swiftly onwards. There we go. Let's grab that. Get some of the ammunition for it. Although, that means I won't be able to do anything regarding my Sten, so I'll have to go and find someone else to keep an eye on it. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, yeah, yeah, this guy will do. Right, everybody out. Pile out and let's get moving. We have much to do and not much time to do it. First things first. Ammunition. Now, grab him. No, he's not my sniper. How it is. No ammunition there. However, if I'm not mistaken, that chap there does have um, a rifle. There we go. Unload, please. Click. And then... Drop his rifle. Take his ammunition. On, if this was representative of real, you know, uh, differences in ammunition out, across um, the nations, then this would not work because the... Um, the Mauser Car 98K, or just the Mauser Gewehr 98, um, used, I think it was 7.62mm um, rifle cartridges while, well, rifle bullets, while the um, British Lee Enfield used 303 car, um, bullets, which of course are completely different in size and therefore the bullets for the Mauser would be far too large to uh, get chambered into a Lee Enfield. But of course, that little uh, niggle isn't uh, included. Still, without further ado, pass this chap his uh, equipment. He's going to be needing it. There we go. However, might need to swap things over a bit. There we go. Alright, and then of course, pop his uh, Bren down there. And we're done. Just in case shit happen. Oh! Ooh! Smart! That armoured car there was uh, hiding from me. No matter. What we need is somehow to get close to these chaps. Spoke too soon. Run for it! That should get them. Missed. Not to worry. In the evening, we'll get some schnapps to ease the pain. Piece of cake. Yeah, I'm sure you will. Now. I've had better days. Bloody hell. Got them both. Let's give them some stick. That was fucking close to 
an unmitigated disaster. Now then, moving swiftly onwards, we have much to do. For example, getting to... where do we have to go? Oh, fair enough, I was heading in the right direction anyway. Regardless, in we go. Hmm? Uh-oh. Seems that uh, these chaps are having trouble. No matter. There you go. The Bren knows no bounds. There we go. Another one bites the dust. Load up and then get ready to take out the rest of these chaps. Spoke too soon. Take them out. There we go. Glorious. That'll teach um, these chaps. All we need to do next is uh, grab some more ammunition. If there's any available. There bloody well is. Now, there are people inside that house, so expect the worst. Expect the worst, hope for the best. Surround the location. And then, move in. Uh oh. Not good. We're too late, it looks like an ambush. Well, ain't that just groovy. Now then. Keep yourself safe. These guys, on the other hand. We need to approach. Somehow. Not good. Alright, fall back, Robert. We have much to do and not much time to do it. Right. Looks like Pop yourself there. Trap. Okay, the bastard's dead now. This chap, on the other hand, is anything but. A planned ambush by the enemy has failed. After interrogating a survivor, it has been discovered that the contact, the female French resistance agent, Odetta Villard, is being held at the local commandant's office. Question. The Germans do not have a reputation for treating their captives well, so time is of the essence. Head for the commandant's office. Rescue Odetta Villard and ensure her safety. Sounds like an easy enough um, objective. Where is she being held again? In there, in the middle of the town. All right, no, that's fine by me. Let's see, Robert will remain outside. However, I have a very delightful um, friend that I'm going to be hijacking, and that should assist quite nicely. The only issue then is ensuring that um, we get rid of that flak panzer, because if that comes around to say hello, then fuck me, I'd rather not get involved. Everybody inside. Get inside. Glorious. Oh shit. Where the hell did these chaps come from? Bollocks. Well that's just fucking grand, isn't it? They've gone and um knocked off most of the wheels. Well, we're just going to have to uh, do this on foot. I prefer not to, but there you go. Alright. There she is. Where? Incoming! Not good. Where the hell's my friends? Oh, for fuck's sake. Take your fucking time, mate. Shit. Right. We've still got that chap there. I know, right? 
We're going to need to somehow um, get rid of that armoured car before we do anything else. Open fire. We're under fire again. Shit. Get him out of here. We need to go and give him some medical attention. Right. Here's some bandages. Bloody well use those. Idea. We have ourselves a perfectly good Panzerschreck. Use it. Holster that. Pop that in. And then, glorious. Alright. Now we just need... Wait. Holy crap. They've been able to shoot out the enemies involved in it. Glorious. Right. Let's move onwards. After all, the last thing we need is... Where the hell are they going with her? Quick. We've got to go and get to them. Got her. What on earth were they even doing with her? Alright, we have her. But, we're not out of the woods yet. Now, locate a boat and escape. Destroy the defender bridge, which is also right next to the flak panzer. Well, isn't that just grand? Not good at all. Come on, son. Show your head. Nothing. Right, well. Prepare yourself. Like Got him. I have a perfect idea on how to get rid of um, those chaps. And it will be glorious. There we go. Now. The one good thing about the Nebelwerfer is that, it, well, originally called the Smoke Thrower, uh, its purpose was, as it, you can probably guess, for the dissemination of... Um smoke. It fired off huge um, smoke canisters. However, it then became apparent that you could uh, use it for launching rockets too. Are they... are they arriving? They most certainly are. Glorious. Right, load in the last ones. And then we'll have some fun destroying stuff. There we go. And off they fly. Right, everybody, to the boat. Preferably without getting shot by these guys. Alright. And then, I do believe... Beautiful. Son of a bitch. Could you be more careful? Apparently not. No matter. There's Odetta, and then of course, there's the other chaps. And there's the other. And that should be it. We'll then just uh, make our way past the river. And that should be the end of this chapter. Damn right we will. Come on, get onto that boat. Fishing boat. Joy of joys. And then... Are you on? He ruddy well is, although I wouldn't sit on that tyre if um, I were him. Not like it matters. What matters, of course, is my ability to steer this fucking thing. Meanwhile, we're going to be sailing right under the noses of these machine gunners. Nope. Not going to happen. Bloody hell. I've no idea how they navigated these narrow waterways. No matter. We're through. Glorious. And with that... I do believe it's time to go and end it there, for we have run out of time. 
But don't worry, ladies and gentlemen, I'll be back soon enough. But, if you can't wait until then, do please check out the selection boxes on my left, or go to the channel itself. There is plenty more to be seen. Thank you very much once more for watching, and of course from me... Ta-ta!